system settings for other countries and other languages. First of all, when you change the language and you restart or log in again, you will see a note that you can uh, rename the folder names. Uh, we suggest to stay with the English folder names and not to switch every time the names of the folder when you change the languages. But it's uh, up to you. So when you log in again, we start, we add first of all one or more languages. So you start the language support tool. In parallel, you can start as well, for instance, the uh, search for drivers, for additional drivers. Both will take a while. Now we install languages. There's a long list of additional languages. You can select, for instance, French in this case, uh, apply changes. It will ask for the system password. And when you edit the password, it will start. On In the other window, the driver named an additional driver, possible driver to install. In this case, we drop it, but it's up to you if you decide to install proprietary or other drivers. Now we install the language. As it will take a while, we go to add some keyboards. keyboards. We remove the US keyboard in this example and add a French keyboard. There's a maximum of four keyboards which uh, the system can handle. There are also variations of French and others. And important is that you remove the hook from keep system keyboard because otherwise you're not able to add. If you show flags or if you show uh, the country as an abbrevi abbreviation, it's up to you. Okay, if you want to add more icons to the system bar, it's also very easy. These are the pre-installed icons. And here are some functions which you can add. You can move them up and down within the taskbar. So handling is very easy. There are a lot more functions which you can use to adapt the system. For instance, the uh, monitor setting. Don't forget to press apply or save, otherwise the uh, system will forget it and you have to do the setting again next time. There are a lot of other things, e.g. you can also remove the locker, otherwise the teacher will have to unlock the screens every few minutes, so I put it off. Another helpful uh, tool is to add a printer. We add one, either it might be a local one or in our example it is a network printer. It will scan the network, find the printer and look for drivers automatically and now drivers are installed already and I can use it, apply and it's ready to use. So it's, it's very easy. In the wiki there is another example how to add a local printer as a network printer. It's a little bit more complicated but uh, it, it, it is explained in the wiki how to solve that. Bluetooth, a lot of other things can be adapted, so very easy to handle. Okay, so finally we downloaded the French language. Now we want to make French to the first language. Click it, keep the left mouse button pressed and move it on top of English and drop it there. 
apply system wide will change all users to French language when they log in. And also we want to change the system settings for date, day of the week, currency to the French notation. So thank you very much. Have fun.